welcome Tauruses. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is the month of August. Um, remember uh, to put on your notification button in order to see the extended of this reading, which is another half an hour long. You can join my channel and connect with my channel. All right, Tauruses. So this is going to be a very good month for you Earth sign people. So Tauruses, be aware of that. It's going to be really, really fantastic. So what we're seeing is some emotional situation that has to do with uh, um, um, seeing the truth. So this month is focusing on seeing the truth, seeing who is your enemies. So whatever is happening and transpiring, Taurus, you are going to be seeing your enemies in this month. And I see that some of you um, could be the enemy to someone else. And I see an apology that you're going to be going back in order to apologize to someone because of some falseness that was created around this person. And it has to do with some of you that some sort of a falseness was uh, um, created where you created some form of a falseness for other people and I see the truth is coming out so you Tauruses it's as if you're working on karmas whatever the karma is whatever the situation is some of you um, Tauruses is working on some sort of a karma situation you have the energy of the Virgos in this month that is going to be helping some of you Tauruses so that is good and you have the energy of the secrets, a judgment call, uh, secrets, a judgment call, a cycle is going to be over. And I see some form of successful outcomes that is going to be coming out for some of you Taurus, especially you Taurus ladies. You are going to be showing up the truth and showing up the deceptiveness that was played. So I see you Taurus ladies are going to be very, very successful in the month of August. So emotional situation, because some of you realize some... <coughs> <coughs> oh, sorry <coughs> some truths about a leo okay some truths about someone that created some false eyed and i see secrets came out about a scorpion and a aries whatever a scorpion and a aries has done i see that is also coming up then i see a situation where a capricorn woman stands her ground and i see that uh, whoever this Capricorn woman is, uh, really stood her ground and showed up uh, the false eye that was played and that was transpired. A lot of you are going to be finding out that a scorpion and a Libran is your greatest enemy. So Taurus people, be aware of this. Be aligned with this because you are definitely going to be finding out that a scorpion and a Libran is your biggest enemy. And this is happening. So, before I go forward, um, the um, la lane on your right end has to do with the secrets that is uh, or the situation that is going to be affecting your life. You're working together with uh, um, the goddesses and the goddesses come in um, in this month to help people. So let's go. We have the first week is a week where information about uh, a Leo and the collaboration with a Leo is going to be coming out this week secrets is coming out and whatever information is coming out is going to help you Tauruses in order to balance out the situation for you ladies this is going to be good because you ladies whatever the emotional situation is I see a judgment call is going to be coming out whatever the judgment call is you ladies are ready um, to take on whatever is coming in. So I see some unexpected information is going to be coming in for you, Tauruses, uh, and it has to, to do with some information of some collaboration that you were not aware of that is going to be coming out in uh, the first week. This is a week where it's as if your spirit guides, and this is the Arcanist, the major Arcanist that is working um, for you, is the energy of the Eye Princess in the first week. And this person is really bringing out some form of information that you needed to know about some sort of a collaboration that some of you Tauruses was not aware of. Now, whatever the secret that is coming out, I see some emotional situation um, that is going to be transpiring. Emotional situation that you are going to be saying, okay, I stand up. 
I will no longer deal with this situation. I'm leaving the situation behind and I'm looking for better grounds. And I see you Tauruses are going to be definitely moving to better shores and better grounds. So this is good. So whatever the information that is coming out in the first week, uh, going in the second week, um, this is going to um, balance out. You have regrets, but yet still with the regrets, you're going to be standing your ground and leaving a situation behind um and moving forward now some successful news is going to be coming in uh successfully overcoming some um emotional situation that some of you were dealing with and this um news is going to have to do with you seeing the truth of what has transpired and you're leaving the situation and moving forward because i see that some of you taurus have no other um, choice but to leave the situation a lot of you Tauruses are going to be having to deal with a judge whether this judge is or whatever is coming in this judge is coming in to bring and end a situation with a Libran so be aware of this so if you had a Libran or you were collaborating with a Libran doing some form of deceptiveness this judge is going to be ending whatever secret contract or whatever you had created with a Libran as we look at the second week another water energy this water energy is some judge call um and this water energy of judgment is bringing in um this is an awakening to a situation and this is some good news that is going to be coming in an awakening to a situation where truth is going to be coming out about some legal issue or some situation that was transpired maybe it's uh, it is some health issues that some of you because awakeningness has to do with most of the time some unexpected um health issues that some of you were dealing with and was not aware of this it is going to be coming out in the second week and i see that some of you might have to go to the hospital but it's, it's going to be okay because the energy of the sun is going to be bringing back healing to whatever the situation is and you're going to be able to move forward so expect in the second week some um health issues if you have been having some form of health issues before i see that this cycle is going to be ending i see information is going to be coming out in the first and second week that is going to be ending some sort of a cycle and bring you in a new direction or some new positive alignment of energies so a cycle is going to be ending for some emotional situation that you were dealing with a group of people this could have been friends this could have been a network or a group of people that you were dealing with it could be your siblings your sisters and your brother that has created some sort of emotional issues in your world or it could be friends whoever these people is and whatever has transpired they have collaborated in order to do some situation that you got caught up in and i see you're releasing yourself so congratulations especially to you ladies then i see some um a cycle is going to be over that is going to be releasing some of you tauruses in order for you to move forward and this is very beautiful because you're going to be taking um what is given to you and move forward in a very very positive way then we see um a cycle is going to be ending a cycle is going to be ending where people find out some sort of is um, um situation that was under um that was happening behind their backs and the truth is coming out whatever the situation is and whatever that was happening behind their backs the truth come out about a leo a scorpion a libran what they have done and transpired and created and worked together in order to affect other people's life where it could have been your friends your kids it's coming up as friends and kids but you're going to be finding out that your kid could be connecting with some friends that has created some situation but whatever this is i see truth is going to be coming out now success is going to be coming in for you ladies because people are seeing what was happening and what was transpiring so a lot of success is going to be coming out for you ladies it is going to be a really successful time that is going to be happening and transpired then i see in the last week the energy of the sun is here and this is what i was saying if people in the month of july and therefore was having some form of health issue i see that this is going to be um this cycle is going to be over and a new a cycle so you're going to be healed from whatever that was transpiring um whenever it came up with health issue or that sort of a thing some of you whatever information that is going to be coming out in the first week 
um, first week, second week, a cycle is going to end in the third week and you're going to be successfully moving out of this situation and leaving the situation behind moving forward. So I see this energy of the sun with successfully overcoming um, a legal issue, getting out of a legal issue um, that some of you were dealing with, success with um, um, a health issue, um, leaving a health issue, seeing the truth about the situation. Some of you um, needed to, to have some rest and take off some time. I see that is going to be good. I see you're really ready um, to move forward in a, be in a very good direction. Some collaboration that some of you ladies had collaborated with. I see you are going to be turning your back because you're seeing the truth of what has happened and transpired. So I see that some of you ladies have collaborated um, with someone in the past. And I see that you um, you are like, okay, um, all right, now I'm going to be moving forward and I'm going to be um, choosing for myself and making a better decision. A collaboration um, for you ladies could work out. So this is good, going to be good. So if some of you ladies were looking for people to collaborate with, um, this could be working out for you. Then I see some secrets about a scorpion. It's a scorpion and an Aries is going to be coming out. So be aware of that. Um, then I see some judgment call coming up on a Libran, whoever this Libran is, whether it was a legal issue or what, this Libran judgment is um, up on this Libran because they're seeing the truth about this Libran and the deceptiveness. What this Libran and a Scorpio and a Leo has done. I see an end to a cycle is coming in and a lot of you are going to be released and move forward. Success is the name of the game. Use the energy in this month because you're leaving the month being very, very successful. Be aware that um, whatever has been transpiring and if some of you have to do some... um. If some of you are tired and feel as if your energy is drained, the last week is going to be bringing you a lot of stability. Some of you wanted to work with a Capricorn person, but um, I don't see um, um, this happening. It's as if this Capricorn person um, realized that there was some sort of a, um, not honest situation that was going on. And this uh, Capricorn person is very sightful. This Capricorn person is like they have a third eye. So they are on top of their game and they realize that something was kind of out of balance. Okay. And this is the reason why they did not connect with you. So some of you were wondering why a Capricorn person kind of keep away from you. This person have a, a psychic mind or a third eye that know when things is not on board and they that is the reason it has nothing to do with you personally it just have to do with this person could have think okay it's a good friend i don't want to um really um spoil my friendship with this person um so they choose not to um 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 collaborate with you so um that is one of the things that is transpiring so i see sophia is here divine wisdom is going to be coming in for some of you um Tauruses, especially in the first week with the Eye Princess and Sophia with Divine Wisdom. Um, this is going to be good for and seven is eleven. So a lot of you are going to be receiving some form of information that is going to be helping some of you out. Some good news is going to be coming in, and this good news has to do with forward movement. Some message is going to be coming in, and whatever this message is. Uh, um, it is going to be good because it's a message about people that could have collaborated against you and now they're seeing the truth. Some of you men was in love with a Taurus woman and I see um, the way you have gone with this situation. Um, um, some of you were in love with a Capricorn woman and the way you have gone with the situation was not the right way. And I see divine wisdom is coming in. And it's as if divine wisdom is kind of, um, um, you know, giving you a message to say that, hey, um, you need to look at how you um, go, you know, because Taurus men, when you are um, out and when you in, are in love with someone, sometimes you go hard on and, and that push people away. OK, and I see that a situation that some of you were dealing with, with a Capricorn woman. Because this woman have a third eyesight, 
um remember it's a capricorn so capricorns are very insightful and whatever that was transpiring and happening um some of you have created some sort of a situation around this capricorn woman and this capricorn woman see that you were not being very honest whatever that was transpiring and this is the reason why this capricorn woman i see you're praying and asking for help um some of you could have really worked against this capricorn woman and whatever is transpiring is as if now you have some form of regrets and it's as if um the divine it's, it's as if the divine come in and said this person was placed on your journey for you to create it uh, clear some karma and you didn't do that and i see that um is as if you're going to be realizing oh my god this person was really this person blessed my life and came in my life for a reason but i never see that and you know you're asking for forgiveness and you're praying and hoping um that um this situation will be resolved whatever is transpiring is as if the goddess of uh, sophia is coming in and said listen we did place this person on your part in order to do good or do or clear your karma with this person but you did not okay now when we look at the middle of the month what is transpiring and what is happening we have the green tahara that is here and it's about salvation salvation and it is about salvation because it is about information um, um that is coming in and some of you want salvation because what we see here is that some of you could have collaborated with a scorpion and a libran and these two have become your worst enemy and i see that whatever is transpiring some of you want to go back and apologize or they want to come and apologize to you or however it is working i see someone who was your greatest enemy wants to realign and apologize to some of you i don't know if you're open for this um but it's all about salvation because whoever that was the enemy or your enemy i see that they're going to come and bow um for you and ask for forgiveness and it has to do with uh, a situation where three people um that had collaborated in order to work uh, this could be friends so, um this could be that these people and a fire sign person an aries a libran and a scorpion has done some form of deceptiveness and especially um these three people want to apologize they were your greatest enemy but they want to ask for salvation and i see that you tauruses are not ready and hoping for the salvation for this person and i see you are like just move along um it's okay i get it I see the world and I see people for what it is. And you Tauruses are like, it's okay. Um, you know, I learned my lesson. Let it go. A whole lot of you are going to be receiving some information in the first week. And it's about some collaboration. Because if you notice, there is a lot of threes. There is the three of pentacles. There is the three of wands. And I see some of you are going to be either walking away from friends, walking away from some form of collaboration, which is... It could be you could be working in business or that sort of a thing and walking away from this because you're seeing the truth in the last week debt and um ooh, oh my god debt and magic oh yeah so um some of you could have been receiving some really um debt is coming up twice so again tauruses if you this is your first time um thank you for coming and um thank you for being here but um what is happening and transpiring is that what we're really seeing is that some debt to some destructiveness that was going on okay so if you notice in the last week debt and magic and that is what came out with the sun so people who were having health issues i see unrealistic magic is going to be happening where your health problem is going to be realigned okay it's like out of uh, the box miracle but um whoever was having a legal issue it's coming to an end this legal issue is going to come to an end um because people have seen what a um um what a group of people have done um, are you connected to this group of people are you were you one of these group of people 
I see ending is coming in and I see a, a judge is going to be standing up and say, no, no more. This is ending. So it could be you who was, um, who had worked with certain people and get involved in certain situation. I see a judge is standing up and ending a collaboration and whoever this, um, judge is standing up against, I, I see that it is the Libran and an Aries. So, a Libran and an Aries. The judge is standing up against a Libran and an Aries and is saying, no, we are ending this. I see an end is going to be coming in uh, to your enemy. So Tauruses, uh, stand your grounds. A judgment call is coming up on your enemies because of some situation that they have done. News is going to be coming in that your enemy is being, um, they're going to be um, um, getting your enemy, whoever your enemy is, whoever this person is that was working against you, whatever this person was doing. The energy of the judge comes up as if, um, someone in higher authority is bringing an end to a situation and for some of you um tauruses be aware because someone could be passing away in your family in this month so be aware it can be any time in this month that you're hearing that a friend or a family friend or a family has passed away so be aware of this taurus says i see someone is uh, being sorry and want to apologize for something um and uh, Whoever this person is, uh, it could be you, but whoever you want to apologize to is not ready for this apology. So I see you ladies, you ladies are moving forward and, and, and some of you ladies want to apologize to someone, but this person is not yet ready for this apology. And definitely an end is coming to a Libran. Whoever this Libran is, so a huge judgment call is coming down on this Libran. And this Libran was working with negative forces. Whoever this Libran is, whatever it was transpiring, this Libran was working with black magic witchcraft in order to get, um, this is how they believe in, um, in, in getting things. And they were using black magic and witchcraft. And it's as if the universal angels come in and said, nope. It's coming to an end. So this is something that some of you could have been under the spell of black magic witchcraft. Bam. No, and they're ending it. It is coming to an end. So some of you are going to be healed. The energy of the sun is showing that. And whoever was sending this black magic witchcraft, it has to do with a Libran and a Leo. A Leo and a Libran. This, this, this is what was happening and transpiring. And there we are seeing that they're bringing an end to this situation. I love you guys. Please like and share this video. Namaste.